Like kids all across the country, seven-year-old Colton Hone's life has changed almost overnight. We can't go outside and play, like go to the park and go on like huge walks. Stay-at-home orders because of COVID-19 have taken their toll on everyone, including Colton. I'm a little mad, I'm a little happy, and I'm a little sad, so kind of much, kind of everything. With no school and no friends to hang out with, the second grader at Hamilton Heights Primary School has done his best to stay busy, helping out around the house. I had to wipe down every door handle and every light switch. I had to dust every, like, wood tables and stuff. I had to do the dishes. Um, I had to clean my room. Colton's four-year-old little sister, Brooklyn, helped out, too. And one night, I heard that my sister was getting $5. So then I was like, oh, ooh, I want $5. We gave him the two, the, the two of them the $5 and go, what are you going to do with it? Four-year-old said, I'm going to buy candy. And Colton goes, well, I want to donate it, but I don't know how. I completely made him repeat himself because I just could not believe that was what he wanted to do. I felt like I had to do something because I don't like people getting sicknesses. I want them to live their life. He definitely blew us away with this idea. Colton's mom, Stephanie, works for Community Health Network and learned Colton's donation could be used to buy meals for folks working on the front lines. I was scared of the coronavirus, so I wanted those numbers to get lower and lower so that I wouldn't have to worry about it anymore. So I decided to give lunches. Chores weren't the only way Colton earned and saved the $50 he ended up donating. I had to not fight with my sister and all my siblings, which was kind of hard. For Colton, though, it was all worth it. We need the doctors and nurses to help the people that already got the coronavirus. I pray every night for everyone that I hope that doesn't get it. He has another prayer, too. That the COVID-19 is absolutely gone and I, we can go back to our normal life.